Okay, so here we are. Um, my equity distribution is in black and villains is in blue. So if we take a look at uh, villains distribution first, he has a really a ton of uh, sort of nut hands and, and near nut hands. Um, then he has some, some intermediate stuff and some, some air. Right, these things have some showdown value too, but in some weaker hands. And my distribution is capped pretty low. So I have a bunch of uh, sort of bluff catching type hands and I have some air also. So we saw in the in the river chapter, um, in the discussion about the small blind better check game with asymmetric distributions, we essentially wrote down the equations that would let us, um, you know, to a very high degree of accuracy, just solve this this situation. You know, define heroes, game three optimal value betting range, bluffing range, and and of course then is checking back range, um, and then define heroes, uh, check calling hands. Um, and so I. It would be a great exercise if you were to you know, go back and try to actually apply that here. Um, but I think just from experience, you know, from what we saw in the, in the examples at the end of the river chapter and that sort of thing, um, I think we can pretty much just look at the equity distributions here and then come up with a pretty good idea of what the equilibrium is going to be.